Good evening and welcome to Compline on this Monday evening. Let's just take a moment to quieten our hearts and our minds as we begin. For Christ, Son of the living God, may your holy angels guard our sleep. May they watch over us as we rest and hover around our beds. Let them reveal to us in our dreams visions of your glorious truth, O High Prince of the Universe, O High Priest of the Mysteries. May no dreams disturb our rest and no nightmares darken our dreams. May no fears or worries delay our willing prompt repose. May the virtue of our daily work hallow our nightly prayers. May our sleep be deep and soft, so our work be fresh and hard. I will lie down and sleep in peace, for you alone, Lord, make me dwell in safety. My dear ones, O oh God, bless thou and keep in every place where they are. Into your hands I commit my spirit. I give it to you with all the love of my heart. How precious to me are your thoughts, O oh God, how vast is the sum of them. Were I to count them, they would outnumber the grains of sand. When I awake, I am still with you. I make the cross of Christ upon my breast over the tablet of my hard heart, and I beseech the living God of the universe, may the light of lights come to my dark heart from thy place. May the Spirit's wisdom come to my heart's tablet from my Saviour. Christ without sin, Christ of wounds, I'm placing my soul and my body under thy guarding this night. Christ of the poor, Christ of tears, thy cross be my shield in this night, or thou son of tears, of the wounds, of the piercing. I am going now into the sleep, albeit in thy dear arms keep, O God of grace, that I shall awake. And our reading today from Jesus Calling. My thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways and thoughts higher than yours. And Jesus says to us, remember who I am when you spend time with me. Marvel at the wonder of being able to commune with the King of the universe, any time, any place. Never take this amazing privilege for granted. Though I am vastly higher and greater than you, I am training you to think my thoughts. As you spend this time in my presence, my thoughts gradually form in your mind. My spirit is the director of this process. Sometimes he brings Bible verses to mind. Sometimes he enables you to hear me speak directly to you. Then communicates, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> these communications strengthen you and prepare you for whatever is before you on your life path. Take time to listen to my voice through your sacrifice of precious time. I bless you far more than you dare ask. Let's move into a time of quiet as I pray. Heavenly Father, be with us this night. Help us to spend time with you regularly so our thoughts more align with yours. Father, we thank you that you have mercy on us. And we thank you that you fill our lives with your grace. Father, bless us this night. Amen.
Let's say the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. My Christ, my Christ, my shield, my encircler, each day, each night, each light, each dark. My Christ, my Christ, my shield, my encircler, each day, each night, each light, each dark. Be near me, uphold me, my treasure, my triumph. Circle me, Lord, keep protection near and danger afar. Circle me, Lord, keep light near and darkness afar. Circle me, Lord, keep peace within and evil out. The peace of all peace be mine this night. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for joining me this evening. Please do take care of yourselves and those around you. And let's continue to pray for our world. Good night and God bless you.